Hello, everybody. It is me, the Prince of FNAF. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. And uh, without further ado, let's jump into the topic of today's video. Today, we're going to be talking about Ripper, the Indoraptor, as seen in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, the fifth movie in the Jurassic Park franchise. This movie came out last year in June of 2018. So, this dinosaur or this animal, we are immediately told is a hybrid, a prototype. And uh, that leads us to believe that there are many imperfections in its design, as we see during the end moments of the movie where Ripper is often seen twitching violently. His body seems to be twitching in random scenarios. Even if unprovoked, his body will seem to be twitching. And his skin seems to be flaking off. His scales seem to be flaking off, revealing this disgusting sort of skin-colored flesh underneath his scales. So, what is happening to Ripper? Is he slowly dying due to the fact that he's not a perfect specimen? And uh, we also know that he is not designed correctly because we know that he is violent. He is aggressive. And uh, we are later told by Henry Wu, the lead scientist of InGen, that it needs a mother. It does not have empathy. It does not have respect. And it cannot be controlled because it has none of these emotions. And so that's why they brought Blue. They brought Blue so that for the next Indoraptor, which they are never going to make, so that Blue could mother it. But um, this failed, and of course Indoraptor escaped and went on a rampage in Lockwood and was eventually killed by Blue. So what happened to Ripper? And why was he so fucked up in the end? Why was he so... Like, why was he so messed up? Now, we often see in the film, he displays moments of agony. He often seems as if he's in pain, as if he's struggling to stay alive. Now, this reason is that <clears throat> he's probably, excuse me, he's probably slowly dying due to the fact that he's not perfect, like I said before. And Ripper is slowly dying of an illness that he could have possibly contracted. Or the fact that he just isn't perfect. Now, that skin flaking effect that we see during the end moments of the film could just be from Owen Grady shooting him up, but we see before Owen shot him, his skin was already starting to flake, his scales were starting to fall off, and uh, yeah, so, and his teeth are not perfect either. Inside of his mouth we see that there are several teeth appearing in the bottom of his mouth that shouldn't be there, which could possibly be a disfigurement. But tell me what you guys think in the in the comments below. Was Ripper really not as perfect as a specimen as we thought he was? And was he slowly dying due to the fact that he was not a perfect specimen? Let me know in the comments below. This is the Prince of FNAF signing off. I will see you guys in the next video. Do take care.